Meanwhile, China has accused Britain of fueling pro-democracy protests in Hong Kong after the territory's justice secretary was injured in London. Theresa Cheng, on an official visit, has been heckled by a group of demonstrators. As she was escorted away, she fell and sustained what the Hong Kong government has referred to as serious bodily harm. The Chinese Foreign Ministry is calling on Britain to investigate. For more, Natalie Powell joins us from London. Natalie, what else do we know about the incident concerning Theresa Cheng? The uh, Metropolitan Police here in London are investigating this incident. We've seen video footage of it uh, released, of course, and uh, in that video footage you can see a number of protesters gathering around the Justice Secretary of Hong Kong. Uh, they are shouting, shame on you, um, and they are wearing masks. Now, at some point uh, during this incident, which took place in the Bloomsbury area of London, just before before she was due to give a speech there. Uh, she falls to the ground very, very briefly. Um, it's not very clear whether she was pushed or whether indeed she tripped and fell. Um, it does look like there was no official police presence there. However, she was brought to the ground, pulled back up from the ground by what looks like some sort of private security. And uh, although she seems rather shocked in this video by what uh, had occurred, it certainly looks like she didn't sustain any serious injuries. She was able to walk off following that. And we've heard uh, from statements since then that she, in this incident, hurt her hand. Natalie, what have British authorities said about the incident? Do we expect a statement in answer to China's comments? Well, I've spoken to the Foreign Office today, and they are expecting a statement to be released by the Foreign Office at some point during the day. But so far, we've not heard any official line from this. This, of course, after the Hong Kong leader called this incident barbaric. But also, the Chinese embassy here in the UK has uh, described this in a statement, in quite a, uh, a condemning statement, saying that these were um, terrible, a terrible incident to take place, and that it shows that these protests are actually spreading internationally now and it's called on the international community to condemn the protest movement in Hong Kong. But as I've said, uh, in terms of the UK response, nothing yet other than the fact that the Metropolitan Police is investigating this incident. Many thanks, uh, Natalie Powell, speaking to us from London.